against bangers. You've got both people back at the baseline and they hammer you. Sometimes it's advisable to do a drop shot. This is the drop shot against players who stay back at the baseline. One is the feather drop and the other is the Kyle drop. One is lighter, the other one is a little bit more extreme in how you execute it. But here we go. Here it is, this is the feather drop. And all I'm trying to think of doing is pushing slightly forward under the bottom of the ball. As the ball comes to my chest level, it's forward to put a little backspin on the ball. Here we go. swing volley drop first of all you're trying to keep your opponent back and then drop it in the non volley zone as soft as you can make it so they are not able to run it down was the feather drop. If you're against two baseliners who hang out near the baseline, oftentimes just a short drop shot is in order. What I demonstrated with my partner's close-up was the technique of doing the feather or the Kyle. It takes a lot of practice to get the touch. You might screw up a few times. Keep trying it. And then I had my partner go back to the baseline and just drive, top spin, drives at me. That way I can practice all the swing volleys in the book and then throw in a little drop shot or a drop shot. That'll get the bangers scurrying up the net. Probably they won't get it if it's a good drop shot. So practice with your partner, the feather, the Kyle. 